Notice anything strange about my Windows desktop? That's right. I seem to have two taskbars, not just the one. And those of you that use the Microsoft Edge browser will note that this particular taskbar is the one from Edge, but you can't see Edge anywhere around on my screen. And that's because in the latest Canary build update of Microsoft Edge, that's the one for people who are subscribed to the Windows Insider program, you can now detach the taskbar or the sidebar from Edge and have it live on your desktop. But first things first, let's see how we can quickly put it back and that way I can show you how to detach it and plonk it over on the right side of our desktop. So we're going to click this little X down the bottom here to attach it back to Edge. That disappears. Now let's go and open up the Canary build of Edge. Now bearing in mind this is a very, very early beta, so it's not available for the production version that most of us are using. Now down the bottom here, we can see we've got a few little icons, but the one in the middle shows us that we can detach our sidebar from Edge. So let's do that. It goes and appears on the right. It's now been removed from the web browser itself. We can close the browser. Everything here is still open. If we want to use the Bing AI, we can do that. We could just simply click over here and have a chat. So that's kind of cool, having access to the AI functions within Bing without actually having to open Microsoft Edge. It's a little buggy, but as you expect from the Canary build of Microsoft Edge, it's supposed to be buggy. It is buggy beta code. So it isn't without its problems, but it's a good indication of where things might be going with Microsoft Edge. I kind of like actually having the sidebar over here. But of course, you have the choice whether you want to put it there or just leave it as part of the browser. And again, little things like the drop function of Microsoft Edge, which I did cover in another video, that's pretty cool, allowing you to drag and drop files between different versions of Microsoft Edge. So you can drop files here from my Windows desktop and retrieve them from my iPhone or my iPad or my Mac, any other device that supports a copy of Microsoft Edge. So that's pretty cool. You've got access to obviously things like there, your emails. You've got access to uh, Microsoft 365, Office 365, whatever you want to call it, uh, a couple of games. And of course, some quite useful tools as well. So everything here is in that sidebar for you to enjoy. Or not, if you don't like it. I do like it. There are some pretty cool things in here, particularly the AI. And there are certainly things that I would use. So that's a sneak preview into perhaps the future. Having this Edge taskbar docked to the side of your Windows desktop. So what do you guys think? I think it's great. I'll be using it. Two taskbars, better than one. As usual, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, do all that kind of cool stuff because I would very much appreciate it. Thank you very much and have a great day.